good morning people good morning welcome back to our channel thank you so much for tuning in and if it's your first time feel welcomed <laughs> if you are always coming back to watch our video thank you so much for your support it means a lot it means a lot so it's a new day and i'm here with baby jazzy say hi say hi good job. Huh? Say hi, mommy. Bye. So I'm here with baby Jasmine. We came back to our house yesterday on Sunday. Today is on Monday. We thank God for this opportunity that he has given to us once again. It's a bright day. As I can see, the sun is out. And yeah, it's a great day full of blessings. It's actually morning. We've just woken up. And I just wanted to share with you what I wanted to do today sorry about the lighting so um i just have this witabix i got it like some time back and i have yeah a box of milk let us see about it you know the goodness of buying these boxes at least they get to like serve you for some time now imagine if i didn't buy it i still have i still have five milk remaining and i got it long time ago not long time ago but last month and i still have like some milk remaining here see now it's helping me so we just want to make some breakfast want to make some breakfast with you guys and spend the day with us today i actually want to <coughs> sorry mama today oh. i actually want to clean my fridge see it's still so dirty i removed the trees and i just want to clean it up and i also have like let me stand like this and I also have like um, laundry to do a lot of it. So we are going to spend the day with you. Let me just make breakfast for me and Jasmine. And then catch you later in a few as I start to clean up the clothes. And probably also clean up the fridge. It's so dirty. And then start my day. Yeah. And I hope you guys who are watching, you're doing okay wherever you are. Stay blessed. I'm here finishing the last batch. Already have, I've washed these ones, but I'll find them tomorrow since the wire line is full. So this is the last batch. And right now I'm on to this place. I'm cleaning it up. Yeah. And after this I'll be heading to the um to the supermarket to do some few shopping and then we'll come back yeah so stay tuned guys I'm done cleaning it up as you guys can see it's now clean yeah 
2,000 years later. Today has been a long day. Imagine I started cleaning up um, from 11 right now, it's 5 p.m. And it's when I want to head out. This is my outfit. This is my cute bag over here. And Jasmine is right here. Jazz. Hi, mama. So that's Jasmine's outfit. Stand well so that they can see you. So ja that's Jasmine's outfit. And we just want to head out because, guys, my fridge is empty. I just need to, mommy, come. I need to go and buy some groceries today and just do a little bit of the shopping. I have not been in my house for like two weeks. I came back. The house was just, you know, you know, when you go out for, for the longest time and then when you come back, your house is always dusty and everything. So today I was cleaning out and you, I just feel nice. I feel now the house is clean. I washed. I did laundry. That's, that is what has really kept me. And um, it's now time we go out. Yeah. Yeah. And enjoy the video actually going to naiva's supermarket to go and buy one or two things so i just want to take you guys along with me as we spend the evening with you guys Hi guys, I have just come back now. I just don't know what Jasmine wants, but I just want to show you the things that I got. So here they are. So this is basically my monthly shopping. When I've done this, I know, like I'm sorted out the whole month. Yeah. So I got this um, box of milk. Let me just put the camera where I think the light is good on the other side, but you'll have to bear with me. Okay. I'm just trying to look for a position where I can put the camera so that I can be able to talk with you guys. So I got this milk. Like I told you, I love buying the milk like this because it serves me. For a whole month, this means just wants to me. And what again? I got some tomatoes. I actually got the tomatoes from a guy who was selling them outside the supermarket because I didn't have. I remember I didn't have, but I'll be going 
or I'll be sending my mom to buy for me tomorrow from Kibuye. They are a little bit cheaper from there, and then also the quantity is a lot. I got even I got potatoes from the same guy who was selling because I knew I didn't have like anything to cook. But then I remembered I can get eggs and cook because I had like last night's food cabbage i cooked cabbage i got some crepes i'm in that time of the month i got myself this these are mine i got bread but i put it bad so <laughs> Why my eggs broke? I just bought eggs from a nearby store right here and I got three but they broke. I got jasmine yogurt. I got four of them. She loves yogurt a lot. She really, really, really loves yogurt. I got, I think, four of the crepes. Because sometimes I'm always hungry, like from nowhere. And then I look at the fridge, there are no snacks. I look at the closet, no food. I got Twitter Bix for Jazzy Snazzy. Just gonna put them up there. And then I got some detergent. It's called Sunlight. I'm telling you today I'm tired Jasmine has been like she hasn't been disturbing but I've had like a lot of clothes to wash and I feel like I'm so tired and I feel I'm so tired I got two packs of indomie let me put them up here two packs of indomie they normally serve me a lot sometimes when I don't feel like cooking I'm not in the moods of cooking and I got here passion passion juice I got the apple juice for Jasmine apple juice for Jasmine they were actually on sale so I decided to take two and then I got this passion juice for myself because I love passion a lot and then I got the sunrise basmati rice I got ugadi flour I got only one pack because I remember there was a time I used to buy two three and for me I don't really get to cook a lot maybe today I cook ugali tomorrow I cook rice so you, fi you found that the rest of the flour spoiled and I had to like um, take home so that we could actually on that day remember I gave my mom the two because I knew that I was not going to use them anytime soon so she called me and told me that the flour had already spoiled being that they stayed here for for some time without being cooked so they had to cook for the dogs and then I got here cork in case like I get a visitor soda then we have your apple for jasmine you know i learned the importance of apple when jasmine was still young and she would constipate and like i didn't know what to give her until i gave her an apple juice and she she was able to go to the toilet so from that day i always want to like put apple as part of her diet i got your matchbox i realized i was only left with one so I got like this and then I got here roll on one thing I'm always gonna like be comfortable and confident with myself so I always go for the roll on every time like I feel like mine is almost getting over or I'm, I'm almost running out of of the roll on I always go and buy a one so that I cannot smell sweat and then i have never like tried this 
um spaghetti but i think they're called pasta right yeah this, these are called pasta i've never tried it out so i decided instead of getting the spaghetti uh let me get these ones and then i got this new blue band that has come and it's with choco yeah i got this one i got they're actually smokies and jasmine loves sausages a lot so i got these ones for her last but not least i decided to get some bath soap bath soap so yeah basically that is it and my fridge as you guys know it was empty so now i'm gonna like arrange everything out she wants to breastfeed and then i'll be showing you how the fridge is looking after yeah so i just managed to put my baby to sleep and i want to do this with you guys as you guys can see my fridge is so empty it was so empty you know sometimes i do things out here until i forget about myself like hey sometimes you need to like do shopping for yourself and don't just be um the cold hot brother we call them brother like when a lady acts like a bro do you know like a broski broski so i'm just putting their yogurt and then i have what again so i'm just gonna put this up here let's put it right there yeah and this is what i cooked yesterday it's cabbage so i'm gonna eat it right now with the eggs that i bought let's put the soda right here then we're gonna put the apples there three banana banana <laughs> we're just gonna put them right there i think i will add on other banana so this is the drawer where I get to put my food stuff and I'm telling you I left the lid of this container open and this is ugali flour so I suppose the ugali flour is not is not good to be used and this is rice yeah and we have your chapati flour wheat flour we have your porridge flour and these are just the things that I got right now. And up here is where I'm putting the chips, the crepes. Yes. And then I got the peanuts. Let me just put it there. This one ended. I finished this. I had this, but I just finished it. So I'm going to throw the container. And yeah. This is it. I think I'm just gonna maybe put the bread here. Don't like putting bread in my closet. Yeah, so that's it. And I think I'm gonna remove the flour and put it in this container. Let's just do it right now, Cynthia. Oh la la. In Kisumu these days, it rains like almost every time, every time during the night. So, I went to the supermarket. I went to the supermarket in the evening. I used a picky, and when I was coming back, guess what? It almost rained on us, and we were on a highway where we couldn't like stop over and shelter somewhere or just in a highway i was so scared but the lord spared us and it didn't really imagine 
it had started drizzling and I knew it's gonna rain but then it didn't rain so I'm just gonna take this home so that they can cook for the dogs because I'm not sure about it that's why I taught myself to only buy maybe one pack of ugali flour because I don't I don't really cook ugali most of the time. I cook rice, but I have to have this flour. I have to have it in my house. I love ugali, but you get discouraged to cook ugali if you're one person. But if I have like someone, maybe my friend, a friend, or like someone just coming over, I get the courage to cook and the sake to cook ugali. Yeah, so that's it. That's it. So let's start preparing our dinner. Our dinner. Yeah, I was almost forgetting about this. It's called milk milk. Bar. Yeah. So I got this container from Sylvia. She had brought it to me the day she was coming to visit me. And this is where I get to put biscuits. Um yeah. And I have another one which I've put some sweets in it. So if in case like sometimes I get hungry in the middle of doing nothing or doing something, I just come and grab on something to eat. A little bit of the snack. You know, because because just feeding is not easy. It's not and you find most of the time you get hungry a lot. So if you don't have food, I know like it's it's tough. Uh, I'm telling you. So that's it. I'm just gonna close it like this. Yeah. So I have like this other one. I had gotten some sweets. I don't know when. So whenever my nephews come, I always tend to give them sweets here and then this other one i've put biscuits in it that's so helpful and then i love the design like the way they have put the the design the decoration right here it's not like plain right now i'm putting water to cook ugali with and then i'm telling you um Yesterday I drank this water. You know, most of the time I always go and buy water. So yesterday I drank the water and I said, ah, so maybe it's just like the one that we have at home. But then it's not it's not the way the other one is fresh. It's like I was having it's called tonsils. Tonsils. My throat started acting weird. I think that's that's the reason to why Corey and Sylvia used to get water, used to refill their water uh, when they were staying these sides before they they moved to the place where they're staying right now. They used to refill because I don't think if the water is like clean, clean. It gave me tonsils and I had like these people whom I used to refill the water with but they started acting weird so whenever i call them they tell me uh, i have to like wait for i don't know how many hours each and every time but they don't like even deliver the water maybe they just don't like want clients these days or so i'm just gonna boil water today and for jasmine I always boil for her water and then put it in the bottle. Even me, I think that's the only solution. I'm just gonna boil enough water for me to also drink. That's it. So we just wanna cook before Jasmine wakes up. Hey, now like putting the GoPro in position where it can capture whatever you're doing is just another thing. Let me just see. Yeah. 
you know it's not like the phone where you can just put it on a tripod stand but i always know that maybe there is um i always know there is a stand for the gopro so i got the tomatoes I'm telling you five for 50 shillings That's just expensive. But I'll send my mom tomorrow if I won't be able to go to the market tomorrow. Let me just wash them. By the way, I really missed my house so much. It's always it's always peaceful and I just love my house. I know everybody loves their house. Okay, let me just start cooking. Let me just start preparing the food before Jasmine wakes up. I know in a few she'll be up. So I want to start cooking the eggs. So after we came back from the supermarket the things were so heavy and I had to like climb the stairs I'm there with Jasmine and the caretaker was just down there like outside the gate and then I was stranded but then it was so nice of him to just come and help even without me asking you know sometimes I don't always want to disturb someone's face. Maybe he was just meditating out there and then I was going to be like, hello, come and help. But then he just saw it. <laughs> and then he came. <laughs> you know, there's some people who can see that and just assume you. But for him, imagine he saw that I was stranded and then he came and helped me. That was so nice of him. I have here my onions. I think I'm gonna cut it into half. Onions have become very expensive. And I'm not cooking like a lot of food. So I don't need a lot, a lot of it. I think this one is just enough. This one is just enough. Let me cook and then after I'm done, I'll start editing this video so that I can post. Yeah, I can post today. Maybe it will be up by tomorrow or even today. Um, late, late in the night. So I've already chopped the onions. Let me just add on the oil. Sometimes I tend to. Uh, fry the eggs first and then it's when I fry it with the onions and the tomatoes and then sometimes I just go direct like this I just fry it direct when I have time I do the long way long method so many ways of killing a rat, a rat right so many ways of cooking many ways of cooking eggs you can see the water also is ready and I love it when I blend my tomatoes so every time I just blend tomato because of the fine texture instead of me waiting for it to cook pond it so that's a lot of time so I think I'm just gonna add water. Hey guys, I just feel like
very sensitive baby. So I'm just gonna add in the blended tomato. Just like that. And then because the tomatoes are a lot, I'm gonna add in some little bit of the salt because remember I added salt on the the eggs so you just don't want to add a lot of salt on the tomatoes because it will make your food not tasty at all <sighs> is this what we call multitasking because already my water is boiled i have to fetch in some water i don't want to pour the water because Instead of me boiling my drinking water again, so you can just take from here. From here. Let me put it here. They have, have stood up, bent down because I don't want to like um, stay on the clothes for long. But imagine I was washing, huh? and then when it was time to rinse, I was taking them out and rinsing them manually. And imagine the time I have taken washing the clothes if I was just using the machine. I would have washed till now because it takes time it's a good one but takes time so because i didn't want to stay there for for um let me just add this right? because i didn't want to stay there for for long just washing clothes i had to rinse them manually and i'm telling you bending bending like that for long has made my back hurt i think i i just developed this back problem after i gave back before i didn't have anything like that I didn't have anything called back problem until i gave back and i think it must have been the anesthesia injection which they injected me on the back backbone to paralyze my lower body i think that must have been the thing that caused caused me to have a, like a back ache back problem every time i bend for a while if you are going through something like that maybe you can just let me know in the comment section and let me know what i can do about it because you know i'm young i'm young and having this problem so what if like i reach this age this age and I'm, when i'm talking about the age i know you all know the age i'm talking about how it's gonna be how is it gonna be guys help me all i don't want my kitamba to burn this piece of cloth to burn I'm just gonna leave my belly to cook now and I'll be good to go now. So I was planning to maybe go for a massage, but apart from massage, what else can someone like have or is, is there any medicine that someone can take to just do away with the back problem? 
and I'll also pray about it. Also, you guys pray, pray for me because there's only one God who can who can save us from all those things that we're going to send you. Only one God. Hi, my, my eggs have turned out to be so yummy just by the look of of it. You can just tell. So I'm gonna just warm this because I'm really tired. Hey. Hey. Being single is not easy but peaceful at the same time. <laughs> Nothing is good. Nothing is good. Marriage is not good. Singleness is not good either. Nothing is good. My Ugali is here. I don't know what this is doing here. And the cabbage is also here. Warmed up. Let me just return this. Like I feel tired. I just wanna I just wanna eat and sleep. Eat, sleep. Wow, and I'm supposed to edit this video, guys. <laughs> help me, oh, help me. I feel like I want to eat the whole cabbage. Or should I just keep? These days, I don't want to eat a lot. Yes, another thing, by the way. I had started going to the gym. But then, guess what? Guess what happened? I was saying that I was leaving my baby most of the time, like it was so stressful. I had to take my baby to my mom. You know, my mom, my mom's workplace is in town. So I had to go to town every time. That's money, transportation. Ah, I was saying that it was so hectic for me financially and also like me going to town to take her. It was just so stressful and she used to cry like like me leaving her i told myself let me just work on my dad be doing exercise here at home yeah that will work for now then maybe later on when i have someone just taking care of her from the house it will be much better so i got these small containers where i get to put excess food and it really helps a lot because you know the cabbage i cooked it last night and it remained so i'm using it today and some have even remained and imagine i bought it at 10 shillings 10 shillings 10 shillings is like how many cents even want to bend let me just put it there by the way I don't want to bend at all my back is aching so anytime Jasmine wakes up I'll just give her the remaining food I don't know if I'll finish the ugadi, but let me just put it there. Hey, it's hot. 
my eyes are so sleepy i think it's because i have washed a lot of clothes and i even washed my clothes they didn't even get to fit like the wireline i had to just put them aside tomorrow it's when i'll be hanging them i only hung jasmine's clothes today so tomorrow i'll be hanging my clothes and yeah we will be good to go so let me just show you my food and yeah so this is my food ugali eggs and cabbage and guys this is where i get to end the vlog <laughs> i'm so tired i hope i'll get the strength to edit the video and um, always know that we love you and appreciate your support keep on uh, watching our video by you doing that it means a lot you're supporting us big time and we love you till next time bye